Hey guys, it's Full Cards here, live and direct from the city of Angels, California. In front of me today I have a box of 2011-2012 Panini Certified, uh, which I'll break here stateside, seaside in LA. Hopefully we won't be denied. Configuration, five cards per pack, 10 packs per box, which would amount to 50 cards. Easy math, simple math. Base set, one through 170. Freshman signatures, I believe are 171 through 206. And then we have the freshman fabric signatures, 209 through 225. Cards 207, 208, uh, not on the checklist, don't exist. I'm not sure what's up with that. Uh, so within a box break, I would assume, I venture to say, we would receive two autos, including one of those freshman signatures, two mems, one of those mirror parallels, and two inserts, two other inserts uh, somewhere on the checklist. And of course, those mirror parallels have different colors, right? So the blues would be numbered to 99, the golds to 25, the emeralds to five, and there are some rare black 101s. Uh, not the best rookie class, as we know. You know, there's people like Adam Henrique, uh, Ryan Nugent Hopkins, of course, Gabe Landeskog, Mika Zbinejad, uh, Jake Gardner. Those would be the ones we'd be looking for more or less. I usually hit like a Ben Scrivens or something to that effect with my goalie mojo. But let's, let's pop it open, guys. And we do have a checklist. I really like these packages. This is the best thing about Panini, the fact that, you know, you get a, a ton of hits in them. Uh, it's affordable. And also they do redeem those redemptions to this day online, even these old school ones after 10 years. So that is the benefit of that. And we see all the different inserts within here. The Mass Marvels are ones that I sort of be interested in. Collision Course, Throwback Threads, all kinds of cool things. And Immortals, of course, are the big names. Uh, and here you have the private signings or different signature autos. Uh, of course, I've hit a Barry Trotz in a box of this type of stuff before. So let's let's go, guys. And of course, we have a man named Tim Thomas. Uh, it even says Tim Thomas. Stanley Cup champ, uh, Tim Thomas. There's the also in the con smite. And here are the shiny, shiny uh, base cards. So we have an Andrew Ladd to start us off, and there's an insert of some form or fashion. Here are the backs of them, very, uh, very panini, very papery, uh, very mirrory. And there we have a Gabrick. Oh, we have an auto. This is our first auto. We have a couple of things in this pack, okay. So this one here would be a Marty Havlat uh, plain jersey, and it's a mirror a version thereof. So it is numbered to 99, so that would mean it is one of the blues. Uh, blue jersey mirrored, okay. And we have a Gagne, we have a Moro, uh, the lad, and our auto uh, appears to be a mirror of some form or fashion as well. So here's our first auto. And our first auto is Dave Backus. Uh, David Backus of your Blues, uh, I believe also of your uh, Boston Bruins. Uh, wow, so that is a really nice one. Uh, real beautiful mirror version again. And it is numbered to only 25, which means this is a gold David Backus auto. Uh, he's had some, um, a little bit of difficulty with his injuries recently, but still. I should mention that Backus, of course, got traded for Andre Kasha, who's a pretty decent hockey player. So he's presently on Anaheim. Um, it's dealt with injuries, often has a no contact jersey on, but uh, still, he's had a great career. He will have played a thousand games in his career uh, at some point. So there you go. Uh, Brian Jonta, uh, Rene Bork, and what is this? What is this? This is. Ooh, it's one of the Mass Marvels, and it's a Nick Baxter Mass Marvel. I was hoping to receive one of these. A uh, pretty cool looking card. Uh, Base insert, but really nice. Uh, decoy, Brad Richards, as well as Jordan Stahl. There are hot boxes of this stuff where every pack has a hit as opposed to every second pack, so that's something else we could sort of use and marvel about. Uh, but we do have another hit in here somewhere. Uh, behind the decoy, toss the decoy into the void. So we have a Ryan Kessler. We have a Corey Crawford. We have a Milan Lucic and a Ryan Klo, and here is a hit. This feels like an auto, guys. A second auto, should we do it? Well, let's do it. Uh, I have no idea what it is. And what do you think, guys? Oh, it's a redemption. Okay, so it's a freshman signature redemption. Uh, these still can be redeemed, uh, so it's card 177. I'll tell you in a second who that is. 
So that that actually would be so this would actually be Lance Boma, I believe. Um, so a Calgary Flames prospect, and he did play in the NHL a bit. Uh, I think last in in the NHL was on the Vancouver Giants um, at some point. So uh, continuing on, guys, and we have a Brandon Dubinsky, we have a Joe Pavelski. And here's one of our mirror parallels. So again, this would be a blue one, I believe. It'd be number to 99, theoretically, Shane Dome. And in fact, number to 99. Really, really cool, these mirrory blue parallels. And we have a Curtis Glencross as well as the Drew Stafford. I feel like I have a lot of Drew Stafford uh, cards. This one feels a bit thicker. I'll put it aside for a second. Not if there's any rhyme or reason to any of this. Uh, another decoy. And we have Bobrovsky. We have a P.K. Subban, a secondary card, I guess. And then this mirror ball card, another mirror card. Uh, this would happen to be a red one. It's one of Luke Shen and, of course, is numbered to 199. As well as the Rene and the Claude Giroux. This one feels thinner. Of course, again, there's no rhyme or reason because you can just as well get the autos, which would be in thinner packs. Plus there's the decoys. I think the cable guy is downstairs fixing the cable and he's making some noise. Uh, but continuing on guys, we have Drew Doughty, we have James Reimer, we have Zetterberg, as well as Patty Marlowe, and Sergei Kostitsin, one time half. Uh, okay. Still four packs, we're only halfway through this uh, puppy. We're a little bit over halfway through, I guess 60% of the way through, I <laughs> say there's 10 packs. Okay, there's Big Joe Thornton. Uh, we have Barrett Jackman. And here we have a Jordan Eberle. Uh, look at this thing. So this is one of the potential, certified potential cards. Another one of the base inserts. Uh, nice one of Jordan Eberle, who's a bit inconsistent, but when he's on, he's fantastic. Tyler Sagan and Cal Clutterbuck. Ooh, we have another uh, insert here. Another hit of some form or fashion. We have Anze Kopitar. Ooh, it's a hab. Nice. Very nice. Uh, so we have Derek Roy of Wa. We have Alex Hemsky. We have Anze Kopitar. Um, we have the Nikki Lidstrom. And we have that hab. We have Tyler Innes. So let's see who this hab is. Uh, it just feels like a base jersey I'm feeling. <laughs> I don't feel an auto. Oh, it's P.K. Subban. Nice. So we have a certified... Uh, fabric of the game, P.K. Subban. That's excellent to hit P.K. Of course, uh, his rookie year was the prior year, but it is numbered to 399. I guess it's just a base jersey, uh, but really nifty. Very, very clean card. The Habs colors look amazing on that. So, this one's a bit thinner. Decoy in here. And we have Grabowski, um, one of the few players who played on the Habs and the Leafs. Well, few, the few do. Uh, Burroughs, uh, Franzen, there's Carey Price, base card, pretty pretty. And a Danny Briere. Daniel Briere, another one time Hab. And finally, we have this last pack with uh, a real thick card, a massively thick card. Uh, I'm hoping we get one of those freshmen's. Um, Jersey cards, but we'll see what this is. There's no way to know until we actually do it. So let's do it, guys. So we have Roly the goalie. Uh, we have Marty Brodeur. Wow, that's number to like 10, that thing back there. We have Keith Yandel. We have Phil the Thrill. We have Marty Havlat. And then we have this massive thing, guys. And I'm hoping it's an auto, just not just a patch. Uh, but who is it, is the question. And it's number to only 10. Uh, so it'd be Drew Doughty, and let's see what it looks like, guys. Ooh, nice! It is just a NHL one, but it's called a Fabric of the Game. Uh, really cool. It's a prime. It says it's a prime silver uh, patch in the corner there. So that's basically it. I mean, a pretty nice looking patch. Fabrics of the Game. Uh, wow, a number to ten only. And it's numbered one of 10. It's pretty excellent. Okay guys, time for the recap. So uh, we did receive a checklist. I'll place that over there. Uh, worth mentioning, I guess. 
Uh, we received some, I don't know, 40, 43, 45 base cards, including this one, which actually states on the corner, if you can see that, signed by the Rangers. Um, so that's, it, they used to do that with the old OPGs, sort of say when someone retired or whatnot. Uh, really cool looking base cards, very Panini, as Panini as Panini gets. Uh, so here are our base cards, including that Marty Boudoir. With regard to the base parallels, we have a couple of them. Uh, this would actually be one of the rubies or the reds, whatever they call it, uh, number to 199. And then we have the blue, which is number to 99. So there you go, we have two parallels, one of Shane Doan, one of Luke Shen. With regard to base inserts, we received a couple of them. The masked marvel of Nick Backstrom, entered league in 2006 undrafted. Uh, kind of cool to see that, nice looking card. As well as the certified potential of Everly, 22nd overall in 2008. He's had a pretty good career, a bit uneven, uh, inconsistent, but he's had a decent career. Nonetheless, when he's on, he's flying. So we did receive five hits. This is actually a jersey parallel, I guess. It's a mirror parallel, Marty Havlat. Uh, number to 99 as the blues typically are so I'll place them right up here we received this one at PK Subban always cool to receive one of the PK ones uh, so this would be a fabric of the game and it is number to 399 meaning it's a plain red jersey at least it's a red jersey which is always nice with the Habs and we totally received this awesome patch of Drew Doughty, uh, second overall in 2008, of course. So this is a patch with a bit of silver. Uh, it's called a Prime. It is numbered one of 10. He's won with Team Canada some uh, five golds, I believe. So he has the Norris, two Stanley Cups. Uh, Drew Doughty, bang. And our redemption auto would be Lance Boma, who's card number 177. It can still be redeemed on the Panini website, even though it says 2013. Uh, so he's a freshman signature, so I will redeem him. Put him right there. And the hit of the box is the David Backus auto. I've never had a David Backus auto, so that's kind of cool. Uh, he was a perennial 20-30 goal scorer on St. Louis back in the day before Boston. Just traded for Kasha recently to Anaheim. Numbered 01 again of 25. That's the second one numbered one of something. So this would be a gold parallel of David Backus. So I'll place him right here. So that's it guys, a nifty box of the 2011-12 certified from Panini. Uh, please be sure to sub like, hashtag drive. I happen to be full cards live and direct from the city of Angels, California. Hey.